Aloha, I'm Susan Nutowitz with letsfeelexcellent.com and I wanted to read you from my medical dictionary here the definition of arthritis. Okay, it says, arthritis, inflammation of the joints due to infectious metabolic or constitutional causes. Infectious metabolic or constitutional. So right there, it, it says to me that arthritis is, is a problem with waste buildup in the joint or around the joint or in the soft tissue itself. It doesn't say that your joint is a lemon. It doesn't say that you have to live with arthritis the rest of your life. And the reason I'm, I'm curious about it and wanting to talk to you about it today is because when I work with folks, um, they sometimes say, well, I want to find out more about this joint pain. I'm going to go to my doctor. And I say, yes, I think you should, should go. Definitely check out things however you see fit to do that. So people go to their doctor and they do tests and they do tests and they come back and I say, so, you know, there was this big buildup. I'm going to my doctor. I'm going to my doctor. And I say, yes, go, go, go. And finally they go. And so then I say, so what was the diagnosis? And what did they say? What did they tell you to do? They said, I have arthritis. And what did they tell you to do? And they said, well, they gave me a prescription or maybe not have a prescription or they said, I have to live with it for the rest of my life. Well, see, that doesn't help. In my mind, it doesn't help because um, it's like saying, it's like the same thing my, um, one of the doctors that examined me when I had my, my back surgery uh, said, your back is a lemon. I don't believe that, that calling something a name like arthritis or spondylolisthesis or spondylitis or um, stenosis or any of these things really, really helps unless there's a solution attached to that name. So that's why I stay a holistic health care practitioner and I don't really care about what it's called. I just want to just get it resolved and get it healed. I feel definitely that if, if you have arthritis of any kind that you're not stuck with it. Like I said, it's just a matter of taking out the garbage. So as I've explained before, as a, as a matter of um, soft tissue and joints, what happens due to a, a lot of different reasons, but we'll talk about the mobility reasons, the joint becomes out of alignment or something happens with the circulation and it, the, the little lava tubes of the um, interstitial fluid don't, and the cap capillaries, don't quite get to everywhere around. So debris builds up. So your pond is happening. The fluid is getting thicker instead of that nice, clean river that's washing through that I've talked about before where um, you, have, you don't have any sticks in it and you don't, you don't have a pond that's forming thicker fluid that's not getting the um, flow and inner, inner exchange of um, waste products and then nutrition coming in. So out of alignment can be one reason, overuse, underuse, uh, and just from waste buildup, from acidosis. So what we want to do is we want to get into the joint, get leverage on it, get those fluids flowing through there with the movement therapy. That's number one. And then also get in there with the diet and the cleansing. So um, if you don't know how to do that, then I'm a health coach and I help people figure out exactly for them what's, what's, what's the best detox program for them. It's not always 100% fruit for everybody. In fact, it's pretty rare that people can take that. So in my coaching 
Do I always um, turn people into vegetarians? No, I don't. Um, it's, it's not really good for everybody. I work with what, what would be good for you in your, your life, not only considering your lifestyle, but considering uh, your body as it, as it is. So there's diet slash cleanse, and uh, another thing that I do in the coaching is I help you with your emotions and your states and what are you wanting to achieve in your life and are you achieving it. That's uh, really, really important too because it can change the blood. Um, if, if you're not really jiving with your life and you have emotions that don't help you feel excellent, then uh, you, you can change your, your blood and your tissue just like that. So that's, that's the third. The fourth is hormones, hormone balancing. So we should be making hormones in our body to help our body and not necessarily taking hormones. And I think a lot of times when people are taking hormones, they don't really know why they're taking hormones. So I like to clear that up as well. And the fifth key that I feel uh, is in this working component is time management. Because if your time management isn't good, then you're not going to, you're going to have issues with rest. If your time management is on, then you're, you won't have rest issues. You can get plenty of rest just sitting down like what I'm doing. Um, so again, that's more in the coaching realm, but I will have more video blogs and tutorials on all of these subjects for you. Okay, so again, the idea is to feel excellent and to have a very high quality of life. So let's feel excellent. Thanks for joining me. I'm Susan Nutowitz.